Hello, everyone. I'm LW, and here we are getting ready to start off with our daily workout. So let's get started. 60 seconds. Step number one. Let's jog. Come on now, let's not play around. Let's really jog. Let's get everything moving. Let's get the legs up. Let's be aggressive. Let's do what we need to do. All right, we're coming up on 60 seconds. We've got about another five seconds to go. All right, here we go. From a little bit of cardio to a little bit of core. Yep. For core, we have to get down on the floor mat so that we can conduct some sit-ups and some squats and some crunches. I'm sorry. I must have squats on the brain this morning. <clears throat> Our rep is 20. So now I'm going to pick up the shorter straps, reposition the latch bar. Let's do some crunches. All right, there we go. And you see how easy that is using the latch bar attachment system to actually conduct your activities. So now I'm gonna turn the mat around towards the wall mount system. And I'm gonna get back in place so that I can do some pull-up crunches. So we're going to use the strap assemblies once again. Put my feet onto the wall mount system and I'm going to utilize the straps and my abdomen, my stomach, to lift me into a crunching position. Stand up position and now we're going to grab the set of straps and now we're going to do the 
body lift. Get myself into position. Now we're going to take them and put them back where they were. And now for step number eight, we're going to use the chain bar. Assembly. Nothing more than a deluxe round latch bar attached to a chain assembly. There you go, 20 push-ups. And now we're going to start back over again from step one. Let me have a little sip of water. That's all that's needed. Just a little sip. Step one, the cardio step. So we need to include some cardio in our daily exercise. So you don't need a ton, just a little bit to get that blood circulating or pumping a little bit faster. Get that heart rate up. That's what it's all about. So you do yourself 60 second jog if you can. If you can do more, more is good. Don't overdo it. Two minutes maximum. If you start off and you go, you can only do 15 seconds. Just do 15 seconds. If you can do 30 seconds, 
Do 30 seconds. Do what you can. Try and get 60 seconds of some aggressive jogging. There we go. 60 seconds. seconds will do you more good than you could possibly imagine. So now we're back to the core. Let me drop my floor mat. Get in position. So now we're going to do our sit-ups and then our crunches once again. We're going to repeat all eight steps. I did 25. It's supposed to be a 20 rep. I'll go back to 20. Got a little carried away that time. Turn the mat around towards the wall mount system. Get back in place. So that I can do some more crunches. Right. From the body lift to the squat. Step number six.
Okay. Now we're going to move once again. Our resistance down with the last bar hand grip down to the bottom. Last bar. So that we can conduct some curls. So you gotta get yourself ready in position. Take a few deep reps so that you can do your 20 count. Essentially, that's what it is. It's a bar with a chain. So, it's called a chain bar. The count is 20. And then we will consider if we are going to do another set or not. Here we go. 60 seconds. Let's go. Guys and girls, let's go. Or ladies and gentlemen, however you want to put it. just want to get you moving because this is what we all need to do. We all need to exercise. Exercising makes you feel better. When I first started this morning, man, I felt terrible. Aches and pains all the way down to my hands. That's right. Everything was hurting. Now we're on our third set of this eight step exercise. And I feel no pain. And that's how exercising makes you feel. I didn't feel like this when I got up, but I feel so much better now that I've started exercising. And that's my point to you. It will make you feel better too. Maybe not from the very beginning, but once you start and your body is used to exercising, you'll know that you need to exercise daily so that you feel really good. So don't just take my word for it. And especially if you're like me, you have arthritis. Oh, 
or or if you have ever visited to the chiropractor when you go into his office sometimes you can hardly move when he's finished with you you feel so good it's unbelievable that's how exercising daily makes you feel And you don't have to wait for any specific time. If you log on to YouTube, you can see more than 400 video demonstrations and workouts that you can do it yourself at home. Just like you see me doing. That's right, over 400. You can see video demonstrations and workouts on several different social media platforms. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, Google, Yelp. And of course, my website, www.lw500products.net, Facebook Market, Walmart, Shopify. Let's go. Let's get this exercise on. Step four, set three. We're moving on to step five, which is the body lift. You like that? It's the body lift. Instead of lifting cast iron or steel, you're lifting your own body weight. That's right. And you can control how much you lift by how low you go. Oh yes, you can control how low you go. You can control your weight that you're lifting by how low you go. And you can also do squats the same exact way by, by putting yourself in the same type of position to transfer that weight to your legs. transferred to your legs, you don't want the weight on your shoulders, killing your shoulders. Believe me, most of us have enough weight that if we are doing a squat with our weight, 
it will be enough. I mean, what are you trying to be? That's how you have to look at it. If you're trying to be a, a regular, healthy human being, this is adequate for us. If you want to be something else, maybe you need some advanced training if you're talking about some type of professionalism. Any sport, you name it. But you can use this product also for advanced training of any type. You just need to step up your training. That's all you need to do. So don't count the latch bar out. Count it in. the exercise that you can conduct using the life bar exercise system. You can be as professional as you would like to be. It's all up to you. And how you approach what you are doing. And how often you do it. So, it's just like anything else. If you want to be good at what you're doing, you have to practice. That means doing it until you're blue in the face so that you can get the most out of it and you're ready for any level of competition. Take it from me, I'm the OG. I'm the OG that is trying to get all of you involved in the importance of exercise because it's very important and we all need to be exercised. So we only have 28 minutes involved so we're going to do another step. That's right. Got to do another set. So we can make sure that our exercise has an impact. So let's not procrastinate. Let's get started. Another 60 seconds. Do it like it's your first 60 seconds. That's right, be aggressive. Get everything to shake it. You want everything shaken up from, from top to bottom. You have a goal that you want to attain. The only way to do it is to be serious about what you're doing. You want to pass the test, you got to prepare for the test. And I know we all hate a test. But let's get ready. Alrighty. 
That was a good 60 seconds. You want to make your 60 seconds just as good. So now we're going to take it back to the floor. Yep. Our last set, we're working on set four. So we're going to get in position to do 20 more sit-ups and 20 more crunches. <laughs> Using the latch bar, the basic latch bar with a strap assembly. You want to feel better and better. Like I said, when I woke up this morning, it's easier, easier to say what didn't hurt because everything hurt. But after just doing two sets of our eight step exercise, I started to feel better. And now we're on set number four. Set number four, step five, the body lift. From the body lift to the strap squat. catch up to you and you're not going to like how you look you're not going to like how you feel I know after a hard day's work it's hard to exercise but we have to push ourselves to do something 
and you can do it. If I can do it, you can do it. That's my model. If you can do it, I can do it. That's how you have to think. And I'm sure there's a ton of you that can do this more, more or better than I can. But if you don't do it, you won't be able to do it that well. Just like anything else, whatever you don't use, you lose. So now we're going to go to the chain bar, another 20 push-ups. We did eight steps with 20 in each, each set. So eight times two is 16. So it's 160 steps that we're doing, or 160 reps per set. How about that? So if you did four set, you can figure that out. All right, here we go. So, 160 times two is 320. 320 times two is 640. 640, not bad for a day on workout. Keep that in mind. You could do the same thing that you see the OG doing. That's right. If I could do it, you can do it. No excuses. Start off slowly. Develop your muscles so that you're not injuring yourself. Make sure you get doctor's clearance and you're ready to rock and roll. And we can work out together. That's right. You don't have to just watch me. We can work out together. Let's have some fun. Thank you all very much. And start dressing a little warmer because we got some chilly weather out there. <laughs> Have a great day. Thank you.